what an occasion out there. How was it for you to experience? Brilliant. Um, yeah, I mean, <clears throat> obviously we met Hibs in the semi-final a couple of years back, um, obviously during, during COVID, so there was no fans in there. So it was a great occasion, but there was something missing to it. Having this, this crowd today and the hearts backing was, was absolutely amazing. It really pushed us on at the end. I mean, as you can see, we were under the cost pretty much the second half, um, even though they did go down to 10 men. Um, I think we could have done a lot better in terms of managing the game, but that's the semi-final for you and the, the fans definitely helped us get through that and, and we, got, we got there in the end. Yeah, you were made to fight for it, I guess, at, you know, at this level in a semi-final. Nothing comes easy, does it? No, and, and we knew that was going to be the case after last week. Um, obviously, we'd done very well last week. Um, I think, obviously, they, they had some, some words um, given to the team. So we knew coming into the game today it was going to be like that. There was going to be a reaction from them. Um, and we had to fight and we had to scrap. Sometimes it wasn't pretty. Sometimes we had to kind of do the dirty work. And, um, yeah, we got there in the end, and that's the most important thing, getting in the final. Where is that goal going to rank? You've scored some good ones, certainly yeah. even this season. Yeah, I think um, yeah, it's up there. Um, definitely for the occasion, I think probably just perhaps the top spot. But um, yeah, no, I mean to be honest, just getting a goal and, and giving that two goal push, and obviously we had that kind of lacking uh, lapse in concentration straight after it when we conceded that goal. That really kind of um, you know made that a bit tense, especially in the second half. But um, no, yeah, we've done we've done enough, and we got um, we got the win in the end. And as I said, I think we can play better. So hopefully, we'll need to do that come the final when it comes. Yeah, well, and now you've you, you know you've got that to look forward to playing in a, a Scottish Cup final. What will that mean to you? Yeah, I can't wait. It's going to be a great occasion again. Um, you know, we know the, the Hearts fans are going to come out in their um, in their full support. So we're really looking forward to it. Um, yeah, so we're gonna we're gonna do our best to get ourselves ready for that. Obviously, we've got the league league games finishing up as well, so we'll be be preparing for that as well. Um, and it's a it's a great day to look forward to. I'm, I'm just delighted for everyone here at the club, the team, and all the fans as well. The the extra thing with that result, of course, means that it might have been sort of in the backs of your minds. Obviously, not the forefront, but that's European football guaranteed group stages for next season. How much for? bonus is that for the club to take them to the next level it's huge absolutely huge and that's that's where we wanted to be at the beginning of the season we set targets for ourselves <clears throat> um, you know we wanted to go on a run in the cup and thankfully we've done that we've made the final um, we wanted to, to kind of nail on that third spot and we've done that and and that's meant we can get into europe and it's something that, that as i said before like the whole club the fans everyone around um, surrounding this club will be looking forward to next season me especially it's the first time i'm ever going to be involved in a kind of european matches so it's um it's really, really exciting. It's going to be a really exciting time to be at the club.